I'm very into kids and education and we wanted to teach them about the community so we asked them, the kids to come down and be involved and helping the community and learning and, and getting involved with the people in the community on the streets. Probably the most memorable one, I think, for me, is the day the kids came back telling me that somebody had stood up in the middle of the dining area, waving a tin can around with money in it, saying, hey, so-and-so has got a problem and they haven't got enough money to do something with one of the kids who can help. And the homeless people put their hand in their pocket and gave money to someone else who was in greater need. And the kids came home and they were just gobsmacked. There is many forms of homelessness and that's what we're trying to change, that stigma of a dirty old person and a blah, 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 blah. It's not. It can be someone that loses their job in a split second and then they're out on the street. Or it's a family breakup, they're out on the street. It can be that split second at any time. I, I, I find it, I get really proud just watching the kids. Like, I can watch them interact with the, with the people who are there. Um, I probably get the most information in the drive home from the breakfast club because they'll, I'll say, so how, how did you find that? Nothing like I expected. So we got in touch with Helen through one of our service projects in religion and through that she suggested we come down to the soup kitchen and help and catch up with people, serve some food, have a chat. Uh, I started going to the breakfast club um, because one morning in chapel I heard Mr Rackley speaking and he said that they needed volunteers to go help out. And I thought, well, Jesus tells me to go and serve, so I've got the time, I've got the ability to go help these people, so why shouldn't they? The great students are fabulous. They're so helpful. I think they have respect for our guests as well, and they just muck in and help out wherever it's needed. They learn a lot, and they're good kids, you know. They want to participate, they want to interact, they want to learn, and they also want to help. And, and I don't mind anyone helping. Everyone in, in this situation, it, I want to teach the kids, the kids. If we start with the kids, it then changes the way that people think of what's happening in the community and also the homeless on the street and the people in the community.